Raid the Spoils stands well. Light on set and away they go. And Vetiver walked out of the gates. Raid the Spoils begins well. Shelby right, Tonics, Frankfurt are all pushing forward. Rank and file just slitting in behind them, settling down and just getting off those smoke and row as they go up towards the 1300 metre mark. And Vetiver gets out the back. So Raid the Spoils just pressed on now after 300 metres and tries to hold the inside over. Shelby right, who puts the nose in front. Frankfurt's just eased into third, going to the back of the course into a good spot. And Tonics has the inside. Looks like Frankfurt's going to push on here. A length back then in the field, the smoke and row. Rank and file, Vetiver the last one. So flattening down the back inside the thousand and she'll be right for Emma Lines. Just as a narrow leader over Raid the Spoils. Thomas Doyle just holding the inside running at the moment. Running third the inside Tonics. Frankfurt fourth the outside the favourite getting a nice run. A length back then to Smoke and Rowie who's fifth off the back of the course. Two lengths rank and fold Vetiver. So inside Pollard's Palace now and they work down the side towards the 600 and Raid the Spoils has kicked up on the inside as she'll be right just to shade that galloper. Frankfurt's about to come up three wide to put the big effort in and Tonics just needs a run him up for the moment or two. Rank and file runs on. Smoke and Rowie behind those before the turn and Vetiver getting to the outside. Raid the Spoils coming to the turn up the 300 metres is given back as a good sight. Leads the way. Two lengths in front of the favourite Frankfurt who's going out after it. Tonics is trying to get into the margin. A gap in the field then and battling away. Rank and file Vetiver down the outside. Raid the Spoils on the inside of Frankfurt. They're both battling but now Frankfurt the favourite gets the upper hand. Raid the Spoils. He's trying to come back on the inside. It's Frankfurt. Raid the Spoils. Frankfurt just doing a little bit better close to home and Frankfurt the favourite gets in a length to raid the spoils third will go to a rank and file in front of Tonics, a gap in the field Vetiver uh, and back towards the tail there you've got Smoke and Rowie and she'll be right number one Frankfurt, Aaron Sweeney Kevin Lamprey taking out race two this afternoon, the fave getting the job done in a real a real battling go up the straight. They'll both flat to the boards passing the 200 metre mark but the favourite just lifting enough to get the job done over Raid the Spoils, who gave a good sight for the Pollard Stable, and Rankin Files closed off nice to get third in front of Tonics. Standing by for the interim numbers here, looks like one, two, three, and six in 136.83 the time. One, two, three, and six. Standing by for those interims to come through. Got a nice run in transit. Looked like they were pretty positive out of the gates and then got a nice run just off speed the fave and was just too strong in the drive. One and a quarter by a length. The winner, number one, Frankfurt, is a three-year-old. In fact, those numbers now official, those interim numbers coming through here, the top four, one, two, three, six. Number one, Frankfurt, a three-year-old, Bay Gelding, Santos, a big birdie for Robin Lamprey, Greg Oldham, uh, Quinton Smith in the ownership with Cam Richards and Nicole Retner reynolds and R. R. Hopkins trained by... Kev Lamprick and Aaron Sweeney taking out race two today on Guinea's Day. Second goes to two, Raid the Spoils, a three-year-old Bay Philly, Casino Prince Truly Ready, Chris Pollard, Thomas Stall, and third went to three, Rank and File. A three-year-old Bay going Epaulette, Bethilda for Carol Hunter, Casey Hunter running on well in front of six, Tonics, and fifth going to number seven, Vetiver. But a good, strong performance here in race number two on the card, Frankfurt. Came off that nice run the other day behind East Maverick. Was only beaten five in what was a pretty strong three-year-old race. And uh, was able to uh, drop a lot in class this afternoon and get the job done. So the winner's about to return number one, Frankfurt. That's his maiden win from start eight. He's had the four minors. That win will take his prize money uh, well over the $40,000 mark. We stand by for correct weight.